¡Hola! 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 ¿Cómo están? Muy bien, gracias. ¡Felicidades! <laughs> ¡Congratulations! <laughs> so, James. Yes. You, um, I think you can only make a superhero. Movie. A villain, right? Villain, yeah. <laughs> uh, evil. Oh, I mean, he's only a villain if you're looking at it from a from certain the, point of view. It. I think okay. he, you know, he's got things to do yeah, on his he planet. Is what he is. He's figuring <laughs> things out. He's going through puberty. He's figuring out what he needs to do on this planet, and he's doing the right thing for him. May not be the right thing for you. For humanity. Or for humanity. Yeah. But for aliens, it's pretty good. Yeah. Or who knows, right? It's kind of saying, like, let's kill the evil. Or in some points, if something's harming you, what can you do? Yeah, self-defense, you mean? Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. that's the thing. Maybe. Like, maybe. Is, he, is he acting in self-defense? That's a really interesting question in this movie. I think he's acting, you know, the, the, most of the movie, he's acting like a kid would act who has extraordinary powers. Yeah. Because he just doesn't want to get in trouble from totally. you guys. Yeah. So he keeps lashing out and killing everything <laughs> I mean, so he yeah. doesn't get yelled at. Cover it up. <laughs> yeah. He's covering everything yeah. up. Yeah, because you know, like when you're a kid, like as an adult sometimes I go, Why was I so afraid of my dad for yelling at me? Like, yeah. I don't care like, if somebody yells. Yeah, that's the worst thing. Yeah, yeah, that's the worst thing you could possibly get. Well, he goes to extreme lengths to stop getting yelled at by his mom and his dad. Totally. And, and this is very easy for you to, you know, you're a mom of two, and it wasn't, it, it has some similarities with I your... I have the similarities, and there. <laughs> pretty much your life. It's not a, pretty much your life. a um, documentary. <laughs> the, the, the questions in this movie that Tori wrestles with I think are very relatable to parents and and that was yeah. my way into the story right you know how do you parent a problem child and what are the limits of unconditional love and um, at the end and also just sort of the blinders we put on about problems in our yes. lives right and the lies that and mythology that get built around you know our our kids and like well he was a genius and and but like we, we like picked and chose the details that served the narrative that we wanted for our family, right? Mm -hmm. Because that was the family we wanted to present to the world. But we left out the big thing, which is he came here in a spaceship yeah. and is not one of us. Yeah. Um, and, you know, but we, but we also felt like he was a gift. And mm -hmm. there's a whole, also there's a whole like religious mythology at the heart of this movie too, which I found there's really so fascinating. Like there's big, big is, ideas right? in this movie, which is what draw, drew me to it. I mean, I think that, you know, so often you hear these parents of really, truly atrocious people and they always say, oh, he was such a sweet boy or sometimes yeah. he's so mm -hmm. sweet in the right mood. Or you even hear that about, you know, about people who are in relationships with terrible people who are abusive or whatever. Totally. They're like, oh, when he's, but when but he's sweet, he's, he's nice. so sweet. Yeah. I'm like, yeah, but no, he's not sweet. I he's know. sweet one one hundredth of the time and the other <laughs> yeah. 99 out of the hundred times he's a terrible but person. these are the, this is what how like this is what makes us human and not animals mm -hmm. right like, we can literally convince ourselves of a reality that is doesn't exist we focus on the the one little good thing when yep. there are a thousand bad things and we all have some darkness right inside we all have some I don't, a dark but side I don't know what really you're talking about <laughs> Don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell to receive notifications. Y no olvides suscribirte a mi canal y oprime esa campanita para recibir notificaciones. Hasta la próxima.